Hey guys, everything's just about done with the new system and the timing couldn't be better for the fact that we, as we are starting to get indexed, we're seeing results immediately. Uh, you watch as backlinks rise, you watch keywords rise. And we showed you that before in an earlier uh, video. Now I wanna walk through just a few updates. So one of them was pretty cool. I just happened to see this. Now, those of you who've been with us long enough, you know who SpyFu is and you know who they used to be, right? That was Velocity Scape back in the days where they have Web Scraper Plus and Web Macros for sale, right? And our TFAN, the Final Answer Now project, was based on teaching people how to use that software. So we were their first large customer. We came to them with pretty much, I think it was like a $40,000 project um, in a month. Uh, and they started to help us build this really massive project. Now, that's way back in the day, 2006. All right, so anyway, um, <laughs> it was neat to see this come out. So they talk about it, content decay, do a little spring cleaning, refresh your content, make sure it stays fresh in Google's eyes, right? So definitely fix it by refreshing your content. The update will pay off for a long time in your organic rankings, okay? So really interesting. Content refresh, how updating old content can revive organic traffic. Now, many of you have heard me say it, and many of you know it already, but just in case you wanted to hear it from a third party that's really big, well, SpyFu is that third party. They're really big, and it's totally worth uh, listening to that point. All right, now having said that, I want to make this point. We have, like I said, we have all of our websites out there, right? So when you do the site colon check, you're just checking how many pages are indexed on the site, okay? So there are 242 uh, pages indexed at this moment from that one website, okay? Now, here's what that means. Uh, each of our websites has 21 subdomains and the root, okay? That's 22 installations, 22 projects. For those 22 projects, there's six page websites. Well, 22 times six is 132 pages. So as Google's going through the main section of each of those projects, they're counting, okay? Every page that gets indexed has links on it to companies and the links going to the companies, Google counts those, right? So when we get these projects out, one of the first things we're interested in is this, when Google sees this project and says, okay, and they get one page, two page, three pages, four, five, six, and now they're showing about six results, right? In the beginning, because that's the first six pages of the website. Then our next level of interest is do they um, attach the rest? Do they start indexing uh, sections of the site? And the answer is yeah. So they found this project, they found that project, found that, found that, found that, found that, right? Well, they got, so, so if they find all of them, we'd be up to 132 pages. Well, this is 242. What's that mean? That means that the system is cracking into the third level. That is, it's starting to get into the sitemaps, okay? So by it getting into the sitemaps, it's going to do a lot more digging. It's going to take a while yet, but then we're going to have a whole lot more pages start to hit and a lot more backlinks as a direct result. These things are coming and it's coming pretty soon. Okay. So in the meantime, what are we doing? Spring cleaning, refreshing content here and there. And we're watching Google start to treat all this more seriously than it ever would backlinks because these are not backlinks. They're full scale referral sites by the hundreds for lots of projects, very varied, very cool. So there was our one website. I just wanna show you how it's looking right now. I mean, it's all over the board. So this is individual subdomain projects, like one page, two page, three page, four or five or six, right? Like I said, six uh, for each of these individual projects that are you know, on a subdomain of a website. So if I just start flipping through these tabs here, okay? It's just catching on to a lot of them. Again, how many are there? 21,000. So is it surprising that it's just getting into these? No. It would normally run a lot quicker, but it can't really because why? Well, you know, it can't prioritize this stuff right now with the economy down over all the news about COVID-19 and everything that's happening out there these days, okay? Um, so they are going to get to us soon, but it's all over the board across. This is just a very tiny sample, right? Um, and they're going to pick up. And like I said, they already started to crack into some of the sitemaps and we know that. So if we just take a look a little broader, okay. So the, the root domains, we just kind of take a look. Well, this has got 165. So it did get up into the sitemaps already for some of the projects on here. All right. 
And if I just go clicking away, 158, 85, 72, 117, 144, 114, okay? 25. So some are higher, some are lower, 74, 50, 71, 213, right? So it's just going through them at its own speed and it's hitting each site at a different time and figuring it out at a different time, which is great for us because it means that these things are being released at different times. For Google, it doesn't look like it all hit at once anyway. So that's perfect. We actually are very happy with that. Look at that one. That's 253 pages. It's pretty cool. Okay. Again, just a sample, right? We have all these sites. So let me continue. Even when you look up a particular keyword like Hampton Room Painting, I just happened to do that one. And I noticed it had a million and a half results. And on page two, I found us uh, number seven result for us on page two. Okay. So literally, and it's like, do we deserve it? No. There are a million and a half results here for a particular city called Hampton dealing with room painting. And for all the guys who've been putting their stuff out all this time, certapro.com, whoever that is, Lowe's.com, Glassdoor for, for um, uh, whatever they're doing here, and so on. So why do we even deserve that? I don't know. Um, and this is our site, right? It's got unique imagery. It is exactly a backlinking website. It's got the information here for that. It's got a video. It's got a, a button that leads somewhere. It's one of our sites, right? It's got uh, external links going here and there so that Google likes what's happening and links to the individual pages on the site. House painting, residential painting, interior, exterior, etc. right? So there you go. That's really awesome. Now, just to take it another step, I was curious. Backlinks for legacy UAP, like a lot of the default entries. <laughs> we have 33,800 33, pages out there <laughs> that talk about us, all right? That's pretty crazy just because of all the defaults, right? And that's even before it, it converts a lot of this into the new projects that have happened since, right? Okay, that's just interesting. Um, now... And, and for other people who obviously did the installation, haven't actually put it to use yet. Then even if you use a particular phrase like incentive program for sales team, right? That's a very specific phrase. And if you remove the LinkedIn results from it, just sheer curiosity. Well, there's 12,000 results. Incentivize or incentive program for sales team. It's a real concept, right? You incentive program for sales team. That's got to be talked about a lot. And yeah, there's 12,000 results for it. It's talked about enough. And what's really, really wild is the three of the top five results are ours. Okay. All three of the top five results are ours. Why are we beating everyone below us? I have no idea. Do we deserve it? No, not really. Why do you think we're beating them? Quality websites set up well, and we're just doing better as we go. Okay. So here's the point I want to make. We want to take this further because everybody needs more these days, right? The days are tough. It's hard for people to keep up payments, but we really need the payments coming in from you, uh, refreshing the content, adding to the projects, driving up the graph, showing the sales team what's going on, letting them run out and do the sales. We are about to release that system and you're going to be able to release and claim positions in it all day long. Well, having said that, and, and literally, that's been moving at full, at just warp speed. That thing's going to be online next week, for sure. And it's going to be so easy for sales guys to just scour, find good graphs, download a PDF, send it off to a company, and make a point. And some guys aren't even needing to find good graphs for particular companies. They're saying, where did you get results? You know, for example, what I show you, I showed you the Doggy Days uh, Park. What else did I show you? I showed you the... Uh, um, used fitness equipment and i showed you what else um uh well lisa moore anyway right and the public adjuster right so just showing these samples you know what a lot of guys are going to do they're going to take that information and they're just going to start contacting all the companies in the same industry like um the whole thing for the the mobile makeup artist in manchester uk we backlinked her from websites here in the us not even many you know what people are going to do, sales guys? They're going to take that information from Nightwatch, download that PDF, white labeled, right, with our logo on it, and they're going to just straight send that to every ma mobile makeup artist they can find and go, hey, 
let us do the work for you as well. Here's the affiliate link or the, here's the link that's got the coupon code. And when they click on it, they can choose to sign up. Okay. And there you go. So again, when people are paying here, they're paying for wholesale. They're paying for not a website. They're paying for all the websites at their metro level. Okay. And we're going to hook them up with as much as we want to hook them up with, which means it doesn't really matter what you sign up for. Uh, we're, we're figuring out on the inside how to mark things as hot, how to mark things as paying, and who to take care of first, second, third, like professional, or I'm sorry, <laughs> like preferred stockholders, really. Um, and it just means that we're taking care of people in the order that they're paying in. So you want to be in this because it's starting to work. And as these guys start getting these deals onboarded, it's going to pick up speed really, really fast, right? There's going to be just sales manager for sales if necessary. Sales training, simple. The strategies are easy. Oh, I should point something else out. I even forgot. Let me point this out. This is neat. We started to realize how can we help the sales team move really, really fast. Aside from even just getting, um, getting or handling all the emailing in, right? So when they claim a position to, to contact them for sales, they literally can send an email through our system. They can just upload the PDF to the email that's already done and hit go. It's got their affiliate link in it. It's got the video that covers what it's all about. They literally can do the whole thing in seconds. Then they can go on to another one. Well, what's the point? We said, let's put up a tab like Nightwatch Monitoring here. And for all the companies that we're tracking and we update things, change things, drop things, add things, whatever it is that we're going to wind up doing here, okay? What are we tracking? Well, stuff you can see. Total keywords that we're tracking at the time. We're obviously going to add to the list as we go. Average position, right? Bat number of total backlinks. The site audit score for the people want to reach out and tell people, hey, your site's kind of messed up. <laughs> Let, hop on this uh, plan and we'll help you straighten that out. Okay. Here's page authority, domain authority. And then there's like a URL rating, domain rating. There's a um, um, citation uh, flow, trust flow. And all of this allows you to just rapidly glance through lots of websites and be able to make decisions on what you think. So take a look. This is week one data. Okay. By the time it goes up week two, you can see quickly how fast this information changed. So you could copy it to Excel and, and have it compare, contrast, and sort in whatever column you want. You could say, I want to sort by this column A to Z. Okay. That kind of thing. Um, and we'll wind up putting up some kind of information in here anyway that does simple comparison so you can see. But it allows you to rapidly find what you want to promote. And, and what you want to say just right on the spot. So we'll have different emails you can drop down, select from, depending on whether you're sending about a site audit or about our backlinks kicking in or about, hey, we did it for them, we can do it for you. So, you, you know, anyone who is doing sales can, can just do that, okay, and earn quite a bit. We'll get the final numbers figured out, but they're going to be pretty strong, right? Sales guys can get like 25% probably of the first payment, 25% of the second, and then an ongoing like 10% from every next payment that the guy makes. We're, we're toying with that. We think that's great um, because it's a good point. Somebody asked, why have them like 25% from the first, 25% from the second? Oh, that's awesome. When, when these guys contact companies, they could change the wording. They could create their own video instead of ours. Uh, they could talk to the company. So we don't want sales guys selling the company something like, oh, yeah, you're going to get rich fast. Just, you know, sign up for one month. Make one payment, then just stop real quick. So we don't want the sales guy doing that. We want them uh, to talk about, yeah, just keep paying and watching the graphs, right? You can always pause it at any time if the graphs aren't budging. And that puts the onus back on the company to make sure to drive you up further, to show you proof or results so that you want to come back into the fold, right? And for anyone who's wondering, which do you think is easier for us? Landing new clients or if somebody does pause because whatever, they kind of slip through the cracks or we haven't been able to get to them. Uh, and we realize, oh, shoot, we forgot that guy or, or we didn't get to him. So let's fix that now. And we push and get that graph going up. Then we can show the guy and get the guy back in the game, right? So which do you think is easier for us? Lending new clients or re-engaging clients who already started and just getting them to unpause and keep going, right? 
so that we can go on their behalf. There you go. So that's the point. It's worth it to us to absolutely help guys out, but they realize they're only paying for performance. They pay, we perform. They pay again, we perform more. They pay again, we perform more. Anytime they decide not to pay, like they pause and they add the note, hey, I don't see my graphs changing, we'll go look and go, oh, do some extra stuff, get that guy's graphs up. And then we can come back and when, when that happens, just show him so that he wants to get back on, okay? So if we have a bunch of companies doing that, then if you're paying wholesale, like 125 a month, and we got five guys in your tier level who start paying us 125 a month, we can hook up at least three of them to your account, right? So that you get triple over what you were paying, that kind of thing. Uh, even four guys to your account get you triple over. So we're going to work with everyone aiming for a goal of three times over as fast as possible. Who do you think is going to get first, second, third treatment? The guys who paid for the most metro areas in their tier, right? For each of the signups coming in in their tier. See, when a company signs up, they're going to have the options. They're going to decide whether they want to go hard and heavy or in the middle or low. And that's going to put them in whatever tier level. So we're just going to work with those guys in those tiers. As you can imagine, the bigger tiers have fewer people. But companies who are really, really serious about being up there when the economy kicks back in, there are a number who are hungry who want to make that happen, right? So for those of you who can handle that, totally worth it, okay? You can make a lot because then you're turning like $12.50 a month into $37.50 a month. That's the goal, right? That's what we're aiming for for each guy as just kickover. That way, what's our point to that? That you can keep choosing if you want to double up your position ownership in the system uh, and you're still putting money in your pocket. So that's the idea is like if you paid $12.50 and you got $37.50 back, that recovers your $12.50 plus you got two more of those. So now the next month you could open up another position if you wanted. So you could have two for $12.50. And yet you still put $12.50 in your pocket, right? That's the idea. Now, like I said, we're going to have like this ongoing 10 percentage thing going out to the sales guy. Why? So the sales guy has an ongoing incentive to keep adding to it. What do you think else is going to happen? When the sales guy goes, there's a three-day window. He's got to move and act uh, with the company. And the company's given a three-day window to act as well to get on. So if they get on within the first three days, right, they come to the page, check out the information, decide to go within the first three days, then their first month, we're going to give them an extra month free of development, okay? That way, they get a strong start. So no matter how big they want to step in with, we're going to do double that level of production, right, if they get going in the first three days. So we have an incentive for the sales guy to move when they claim a company. By the way, why does a sales guy even claim a company uh, to contact? Because we don't want 50 people sorting the, the graphs a certain way and all of them see the same company and all of them go contacting that guy at the same time. Right? That's just insane. That's for sales, right? Um, just letting you know. So anyway, that's its own income stream through the system, right? We're, we're, we're intending to build that in order to make people get paid, right? So for those of you who are holding positions and you don't want to do any kind of sales, you're holding the positions, you're paying for the stuff to happen, you're paying for all the wholesale, for us to be able to do all the things that make all this happen. I actually took a, took a list real quick of that, of what that means. Wholesale pigs. That's house program rentals. That includes Moz. Nightwatch, Get Response, SEO Site Checkup, Stack Counter, uh, Grammarly, three servers in house, and then um, the GoDaddy Domain Buyer Club and a stack of domains, right? It also pays for Crew One, that's the designers and developers who are uploading and doing the colors and the images and so on for all the uh, runs. Then there's Crew Two who's doing the keyword research, uh, getting the companies to backlink, you know, the destination URLs, um, and handling the SEO work. Then there's the hack, uh, the guys who actually have the domains and the servers. All this needs to be covered out of wholesale. Then comes what? Uh, retail pays, and that should just be two groups. Sales commissions, and position owners, that is these, right? These are the positions that you own when you get it on them, okay? And that's the point. To make it very, very simple to, to get the sales guy, 
great incentive for kicking in and gets you build up income streams so that you keep wanting to come in harder as you can and we can help you out more and grow it all. Okay. Now, when you start and you're not really sure what you, you want to get in with, start at whatever dollar amount you can handle and just put your email address and then put choose for me. Really doesn't matter. It's when we start getting the deals and the sales guys are locking in deals, we're going to line you up in the order you came in and just start setting you up with payments. Okay. And getting everyone paid out. That's exactly what we're pushing and what we're going for. And we're about there because <laughs> Google's indexing these sites. Uh, backlinks are driving up graphs. We're making it incredibly simple for sales to be able to push forward with that and incredibly easy for companies to be able to land through a link and start their own project literally right off the bat. And we're creating the incentives for everyone to move really fast, like within the first three days. Okay. So that's what we have going on and why you want to be involved for sure. All right. Definitely get in and get going. It's a really big deal. Don't miss out. I've, I've had some guys clicked on this idea where, you know, if you have a few guys in each tier level, some guys literally ask me, Dave, where's a tier level where there aren't really that many people? Just so you know, uh, this is the most common, the 125, 250s and yeah, so the most common has been 125, 250s not that common. 500 is pretty common. There's a case or two where we have had somebody in at 250 who actually had two of these. So basically 500. They were just splitting it up. Um, haven't had any of these. Okay. Um, I, I think we had one of these, but it was short term. And then we've had a few of these. Okay. So numbers count is probably this had the highest number of people. This the second highest. This the third highest. This these two almost no one, okay, and um, also really rare. So if you were coming in, this is a tier one, tier two, tier three, four, five, six, right? So if you were just starting now, then you've got the longest wait at this level, but a quite a bit shorter wait at this level. Um, you've got medium wait at this level. Almost no weight here, almost no weight there, and a longer weight here because there are guys ahead of you in each case, right? But I'm just telling you that's kind of a trick, all right? So for those of you who are saying, how do I get in and get moving really fast? Get in at the 250, 750, or 1,000 a month positions because there are very few to no people there. Um, and so, again, it's just a question of when the sales guy brings somebody in, they're going to start at whatever level they can afford. They're going to see really, really clearly, the companies will, that the higher they pay, the faster they climb. And so they'll come in at whatever level they can. Now, we don't know what they're going to come in at. But like anybody else, they're going to, some of them are going to come in, maybe testing. But these are not individuals. These are companies who are going to get the point, especially starting with the PDF. They're going to get that point, right? So they're really going to come in wherever their budget lets them. And since everyone's hungry to be at the top when the economy kicks back on, no one really knows when that is. Chances are really good. This or this. And then for companies that are just having trouble moving that fast, this. Okay. Are like the three best spots you can be in if you're brand new. Otherwise, just come in at whatever level you can. Okay. And this is a nifty trick. <laughs> Those of you coming in with two of these... <laughs> then you're probably better off because you got two of these than if you came in with one of those, honestly, okay? But again, if you can swing this or this, you're, I, I'd have to go back and double check, but you might be first in line right now at either one of these levels, okay? For the first company who comes and hooks up at one of these levels, all right? Um, the name of sales is to get them coming in and let them choose what they feel like choosing, right? And as the clients sign up, those are the people we're going to go through to start hooking them all up with payments. Okay. Um, and we'll probably go round robin anyway through the payees, all of them. You know, it, it, like when somebody signs up here, it's going to go to the first guy, the one who's been on the longest. And then when the next guy signs up, we'll hook the second guy up, then the third guy up, the fourth guy up as we go through that list. Right. And same with all the rest. Okay. Uh, just it's fair, right? We're trying to be as fair as we can, move as fast as we can, get as many sales guys going as we can. 
But for any company who comes in and they just start at one of these levels here, like I'm saying, there's a, it's a really short lines. Okay, just so you know. All right, so um, yeah, I should update this, and I will soon. There's so many things happening at once, y'all know. But it's I, I'll be releasing uh, the whole system later and how we migrate the people in who are on the payment plans here. And yeah, you're gonna want to be part of that. Okay, and then as a final weekend bonus. Anybody who makes a payment, okay, start the, that a payment that includes this week. Uh, this is Friday now. Moving forward um, for the week, okay. Anyone who does, you're gonna get the right to choose any one of these things to have for yourself to play with, right? It'll it'll have the UAP content. You'll get Moji toolbar. You'll get uh, the TDHA toolbar. Okay, um, what else? Yeah, the UAP content and those two, it's pretty much it. But, oh yeah, you can choose whether you want it on your own domain or any subdomain that we have in the system. So when you guys sign up, just give us a bit. We're gonna get a page up where you can just go and you can select your stuff and tell us what you want and we'll just go straight forward with it and you'll get your benefit, right? We're getting close to the end. We really need all the support you guys can handle to keep pushing us up over the top of this because it's so, so close to paying everyone out so well, okay? So yeah, don't let up, uh, keep pushing, grow, and for all you guys who haven't got in yet, get in. We're giving the most away that we can. We're helping people the most things. If you have a very specific request and you're working with us, we're gonna try to work with you and get you that request, okay? Let's do this and make this thing finally happen. This is a new portfolio system. It's like the birth of a whole new industry in a way. A portfolio based on website returns. And where else can you go and somebody else did all the work and you're just paying in the end to ride that curve, okay? We're there, all right? It's about to happen. So definitely be in. This is the best way to restore wealth to the middle class coming out of this pandemic that I can think of. It's helping companies want to be part of what we're doing and you guys are making it possible for us to show as many companies as we can what we can do for them and grow them at a faster level than anyone's seen. All right, hope you found it interesting and I can't wait to see you aboard. Take care.